Thank you, Mr. Speaker, for all members. The sight of men being manhandled by police, handcuffed to the back of their van, and the van driving away while it's been dragged behind it, it will be hard for the nation to forget. With many communities already taking the law into their own hands, how can be expected to trust the police when they also know better than criminals? The image of the, poli of the police is in tatters, with communities across the country having very little faith that the police can do their job. From traffic officers demanding the, and uh, taking bribes, rape victims being victimized even in the police station, non-criminal terrorizing communities, people do not see the police being on their side. This has resulted in the widespread vigilantism in communities where there is a perceived lack of police commitment to reduce criminal activity. How can citizens be expected to follow the law when they are constantly let down by those who are supposed to protect them? Effective and practical steps need to be taken to ensure that the image of the police not only improves among the citizens, but also the criminal activities are dealt with while the community works alongside police to make their lives better. It can be, it can be the norms of people for the, to live amongst gangsters and, and criminals while the children are in danger of their being members of this group or their victims. I thank you, Speaker. Um, Coop.